Yeah, no, well, we design really far in advance at Nike, and um, I knew <laughs> I knew that I um been working really, really hard in the off-season to be incredibly fit and incredibly ready, and, uh, you know, I took a year off and, you know, just get back with still trying to get 12 months under my belt of playing, actually, so... Um, yeah, I, I wanted to be fit, and I came back, and Nike always wants to make an incredibly strong, powerful statement for um, moms that are trying to get back and to get fit, so that was basically for me. It's a Serena Tard. <laughs> <laughs> um, consistency, I didn't make too many unforced errors, um, I think. She's a tricky player. It could have been easily a 6-3, 6-4 match, or three set match she's been able to beat some top players number one and number two so she knows how to play um, so I think always when I have a tougher round or I know someone that's really good I really was I really want to be focused and then that was really helpful for me today it's definitely different to travel with a toddler as opposed to a baby an infant infants I think is easier and everyone said it's easier and I didn't quite understand um, Olympia takes a lot more attention now which is why I'm trying to get out of here, <laughs> um, but it's, no, it's fine, but it's, um, it's cool, it's really cool to be a mom, and to be her mom in particular, I feel really special, and Kwe Kwe is um, a doll I got for her, I wanted her to have a black doll, um, growing up, I, I didn't have that many opportunities to have black dolls, and, you know, I was just thinking, like, I want her first doll to be black, and, you know, her heritage, obviously she is, she's um, mixed, she's Caucasian and black, but I feel like that was her first doll, and I said her second doll would be Caucasian, and um, so I definitely want to always teach her love and teach her um, just basic human, what humans should always have love for each other, no matter what color they are. Um, actually, um, my nephew did. We were all sitting in our living room, and we were running around names, and he said, call her Quay Quay. And so he actually is the magic behind the name. So um, Spending a lot of time with my daughter, I think that's the priority for me. Um, and I feel like it, literally every moment I get, I practice, and then I, I go home. It's kind of what I do in Florida. I train, and I go right home, and I spend the rest of the day with my daughter. And for now, I, um, as a working mom, I feel guilty. Um, and I understand that that's normal, but, um, and these are years I'll never get back. And so I just try to spend every moment that I can when I'm not working with her. And for me, that's super important. Yeah, I, you know what, I've kind of just let that all kind of go and I just go every day and I don't want to give myself a ranking anymore. I think it gives me too much, um, ex too much uh, negative expectations as I always expect to reach the sky and anything below it is not good enough for me so um, I don't know I just know that I'm going in the right direction I feel like I'm in the right direction and we'll see